Hello friends and welcome to my channel. In this video I will show you how you can repair an amplifier, receiver amplifier with uh, six speaker outputs. Let's begin. I took this uh, PCB down because uh, half of this uh, speaker outputs had no signal for the speaker. And uh, my first hunch was that uh, audio amplifier I see it's broken. But I put uh, here alternative supply voltage, differential alternative voltage. This is the supply for audio amplifier and I tested every amplifier and uh, every IC is good. And then these uh, audio outputs are not uh, connected uh, all time to the speaker connector. They have protection and uh, for protection they use a special relay like this. This is special relay with three contacts and this one with four contacts. I uh, let first of all let's test this. To test this relay I will apply 12 volts. This is a 12 volts relay. I will apply uh, 12 volts here on the winding. And now let's measure contacts. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. And this. As you can see, none of uh, these four contacts is good. Now let's open this and see why. I bet that uh, first thought is to replace that relay, but it's very special uh, relay shape and it's very hard to find exactly pin position and voltage. And that's, let's see what we will found inside. And now I hope that you can see there is a lot of dirt here on uh, relay contacts and uh, if uh, if you will uh, and also on the pair of uh, the contacts it's also a lot of dirt but it's uh, hard to see but this one it's uh,
it's obviously very very dirty now let's use some cleaning solution I hope that you can see it's not perfect but it's good let's use more solution I've took a lot of dirt now let's put everything back and see what happens now When you took this uh, cover off, it's a very good idea to check these wires, so not be interrupted. I check and all these four wires are good. Now let's make another test. As you can see, when I power this relay, attracts. Now let's check the contacts. Good. Good, good, that's perfect. Now I will put uh, everything back and I'm sure that it will work perfect now. I forgot to tell you something very important. If you have uh, a receiver with multiple outputs like this, and you want uh, this to have a, this relay have a long long life best solution is to power uh, this amplifier with uh, minimum volume and after this uh, relay is on just then to increase the volume because if you will power this amplifier with a big volume then when this relay will be on here will be a spark because of the big current and the big voltage and this spark will make dirt and in time here will be dirt again and uh, you will not have the sound and that's why I recommend to you that uh, power this up with minimum volume and just after the relay is on to set the volume what you need if you have any questions please put it in a comment and if you find this helpful please give a big like and subscribe see you in my next video bye